Hello, and today you're with Luna, Milo, Hugo, Walty, and Chester, and Mabel. <laughs> So I hope you enjoy my uh, little videos. I'll try and just do it just to bring the joy really because I think in this world, I heard it on TV yesterday, someone called it the age of rage, which is awful, isn't it? And uh, I suppose with all the news we're fed and all the media, it's all very negative and making life very sound very difficult and tough, which it can be, of course it can. But why I do these videos is so you can just see just your joy really if the dogs enjoying themselves having fun and running about and just having a good time really and I hope that brings a bit of a, a bit of happiness a bit of a happy place um, today I've got six of them which is uh, keeps me busy Walty and Hugo come from the same house uh, the other four don't they're all from different homes but they've come to love each other over the uh, months or weeks or years that they've all been together and uh, get on really well. You alright Milo? You good boy? You having fun? Yeah? You guys having fun? I know. Come on then. Oh, oh yeah I know. Oh. Chester barks because um, for a long time at the beginning he used to always have a ball thrown for him by me and by his owners and stuff and uh, so now he always, when he comes back over he's always expecting something to be thrown so he gives you a little bark to let you know. But when I do a group walk I tend to not really use anything, I don't get any sort of um, balls or toys out because it can cause resource guarding with dogs and uh, some like to hold on to them, the others are trying to get them so it could, it could trigger fights and things like that. Um, so that's the reason I don't use anything really. I just let them all be together, play together, run together, and they just enjoy themselves more that way. So uh, yeah, that's the way I do things. Sometimes if I've got one or two dogs, I'll get a ball. They might find a ball on the way through and they, one of them will run around with that. But generally I don't get them out to actually uh, exercise them with that. I'd just rather do a long walk and let them run around and swim and do all the things dogs should be doing. Isn't that right, Walty? Isn't that right, darling? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Go on in. Gorgeous over here today. All these flowers have come out. Little buttercups. Look lovely. Careful you two, it's <laughs> funny. You racing. Encouraging, you're coaching her. Oh, you're, you're coaching her. 
Oh. See she comes. <laughs> so if you feel that it's all getting a bit too much and it's uh, like the age of rage, <laughs> it's not nice, and um, you are feeling a bit stressed with it all, just come out for a walk, whether you've got a dog or not. It's just the most um, sort of mind um, health you can have, really. It's just lovely, especially if you have got a dog. There's no reason to not go out, really. It's just the best thing to do. And uh, these guys will love you for it. And, uh, and you'll enjoy it yourself. Clear your minds, get away from the news, get away from all the horrible stuff going on and just walk. Just clear your head. <laughs> have a great day.